what is up my error receiving home dogs today I'm gonna to be teaching you how to fix easy anti-cheat error 30,004 or 30,001 they are very similar errors they have the same root cause at least I've found so I know what they say you know you gotta scan now you gotta run disk checker look I've, I've, I've done the works all right, none of it works. And then they're going to tell you, oh, well, I mean, your Windows install is corrupted. You're going to have to reinstall Windows. And yet, if you look into it, you're going to find people who say, hey, I reinstalled Windows. It's still not working. And this is because it's an easy anti-cheat error. This error has been kicking around for many, many years. This effectively, I, I looked at the crash reports because sometimes it can make your computer blue screen. It's like searching for a registry that doesn't exist. And then it's just being like, ah, oh, well, fuck, we can't find it. Holy, th 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 shut it all off. Shut it where we're cooked. So what you're going to want to do is effectively do a clean install of Easy Anti-Cheat. You're going to want to go to Properties, Installed Files. You're going to want to Browse, go to Game. Then you're going to want to go to Easy Anti-Cheat. You're going to want to hit Uninstall Easy Anti-Cheat EOS Setup. You might get a little pop-up. I know it says syntax of the command is incorrect. Uninstallation is complete. That's the main thing you're looking for. That's good. All right. Then from there, you're going to want to type in run to that little thing right there. You're going to want to go to system32. From here, you're just going to want to scroll all the way down to the ease section. You should have it alphabetically sorted. Uh, you're going to be wanting to look for like pretty much any of these files that say EAC. And like they have to start with EAC and just delete them. Now, after doing this fix, they're not going to be there anymore. They might not be there. Don't worry if they're not there. If they're not there, just carry on to the next step. So from here, you're going to want to go to your program files, 86. Go to Easy Anti-Cheat EOS. You might also have a file, Easy Anti-Cheat. Uh, you might have both. Just go to right-click this little thing right there. Delete it. And then if you have another easy anti-cheat folder, do the exact same thing to the system file. Now, from there, you're going to want to go back to your Elden Ring. And you're going to want to create a shortcut for easy anti-cheat EOS setup. And you're going to want to go to the properties. And at the end of it, you're going to want to add space install prod-fn should look just like this that's going to be good you're going to want to run this yes and from there your Elden Ring should boot up now keep in mind every time that you turn off your computer you are going to have to do this again I do not know why but the errors come back if I do not do a clean installation of Easy Anti-Cheat every single time I reboot my computer. Yeah. I mean, if the error still persists, it probably is a corrupted Windows. Uh, waiting for a game means you've done it correctly. Yeah, it's, you know, good that you don't got on install your whole fucking operating system, lose all your shit. But, uh, yeah, this is pretty stinky. I hope they fix it soon. Hope this fix helped.